Hi, I'm Hilary Victoria and I've been asked by one of you guys to just discuss the classification and categorization, that's difficult to say, of offences. So there are three categories that we'll look at generally, which are summary only, either way and indictable only. Summary only offences, you will only see it in magistrate's court and um, generally you're looking at uh, up to six months in prison and or a fine. Now then, these offences are your basic offences, so like motoring offences and things like common assault. So you don't really want to be going all the way up to Crown Court and wasting a jury's time for that kind of thing. So it generally ends up in just a fine unless, you know, you go to prison. Let's try not to do that, yeah? All cases um, will pass through the magistrate's court, but summary offences stay there. They kind of cap there. And that's because when they go to the magistrates, they get bumped up when they look at things like the severity and what they've actually done. So if we look at either way offences now, that's where it could be tried at the magistrate's court or the Crown Court. So an example of an either way offence would be something like theft or criminal damage, ABH. So I've just been talking about assault and a different one. So actual bodily harm, those things there, which depending on the severity of what you've done, could indicate whether you're going to the magistrates, which is less serious, or the Crown Courts, which is more serious. So, yeah, as I mentioned, all cases do pass through the magistrates, but if it's an either way offence, they'll look at the severity of the crime and then decide where it's going to go. Indictable only offences will go pass straight through and head into Crown Court, and that's because of the severity of what those crimes are. Examples of indictable only offences are murder, rape, robbery, the, the big ones, okay? So, they're your offences, a classification. There are three main ones that we'll look at. Summary only, either way, or indictable only. Now, here's where it gets confusing, right? Sometimes, either way offences are also called indictable. But the key thing is to differentiate between indictable and indictable only. Indictable only means it will only go to the Crown Court. Summary only will mean it will only go to the Magistrates Court. You either way, or sometimes known as indictable, could go either way, depending on the severity of the crime. So let's just list some of those crimes again. Summary only, common assault. No one's really got it, okay? Then when we're looking at either way, we're looking at, let's look, criminal damage, theft, ABH, actual bodily harm. Depending on how severe that is, you could stay at the magistrates or you're off to crown. Yeah, indictable onlys, murder, manslaughter, rape. There is no going down to the magistrates for those crimes. You'll be tried at the Crown Court with the judge and the jury and all that kind of stuff because that crime is so severe, it needs that level of expertise and um, justice needs to be served for those victims. I hope that makes sense. Thank you very much for asking these questions. Please do keep them coming in. In the meantime, stay safe, look after each other and please don't commit any crimes.